Over here I found growing what I believe is a yellow flowered wood sorrel. Now I'm not a botanist, but I've tried to look into this. It has some nice properties geometrically. Uh, for one, we see that we have some nice rotational symmetry. And then if you look at individual leaves, you can see a reflexive uh, symmetry. Now, these are easy to confuse with these other things, which are types of clovers. And uh, I didn't really know the difference at first between sorrels and clovers. But that's something that you get to learn along the way as you study things. These uh, grow kind of almost looks like a cluster, but they do have some sprouts along the stem of the plant. And notice that as with as is with common with a lot of plants, they grow in a spiral up the main stem and to move from one stem that say sprouts off in this direction down to one further down that sprouts off in the same direction. These tend to happen in rotations that are Fibonacci numbers. We see the development of the Fibonacci sequence, though not by name, in a book from 1892, which was written for general audiences. Uh, in the same text, in the same section, we also see a note from the author that Chauncey Wright had developed a mathematical theory for botany, which seems to have been rejected. Uh, but this is an interesting historical note to see uh, mathematics and science coming together to attempt to develop a botanical theory. I hope you've learned something from this. I know I certainly have. Cheerful calculations.